Hi writers, my name is Melissa. Today we're gonna to write some poetry together. Poets make choices about the conventions, techniques, and language they use in their poems. They do this to help the reader feel, think, and understand their poem. Today I'm going to share a strategy with you that has four different steps. First, you need to decide what you want your poem to be about. Second, you want to think about poems you've read and poetic techniques they used. Third, you're going to ask yourself, hmm, which of those techniques do I want to try in my poem? And then finally, you'll decide on one and give it a go. I'm going to share with you a poem that I wrote earlier today. I decided that I wanted to write about school because I really miss seeing the kids at school and my teacher friends. And I kind of think the schools are lonely without us. So first I decided on my topic. Second, I thought about other poems that I've read and what techniques they used. In some poems I've read, I noticed that the poet repeats words again and again and again. So I tried that in my poem today. I'm going to read it to you first without showing it to you, and I want you to listen for the repeated words. Here we go. It's called Missing by Melissa. Clocks on classroom walls tick, tick, tick into silence. Desks and chairs are empty, empty, empty of children. School hallways and classrooms are clean, clean, clean and ready for all the kids and teachers dreaming, dreaming, dreaming of a new school year. Did you hear the words I repeated? I'm gonna read it to you one more time and let you see the poem. Missing by Melissa. Clocks on classroom walls, tick, tick, tick into silence. Desks and chairs are empty, empty, empty of children. School hallways and classrooms are clean, clean, clean and ready for all the kids and teachers dreaming, dreaming, dreaming of a new school year. Did you see my repeated words? Tick, 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 empty, 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 clean, clean, clean and dreaming, dreaming, dreaming. I thought it was really important what I wrote about today. So I chose to repeat those words three different times. So now it's your turn to try. Think about what you want your poem to be about. Think about other poems you've read and techniques that they've used. Decide which technique you wanna try and then give it a go. Happy writing, bye.